It's a rare morning indeed. The sun is shining. <laughs> it's wonderful. I look up at the sky and there's those strange clouds again. I never seen those when I was growing up. I remember doing geography at school and we were taught about cumulus, nimbus and stratus and cirrus and all these different types of cloud formations and we were brought outside and told to um, identify them and draw them and name them. Gosh, we had to learn so much about cloud formations. Well, I'm looking up now and I'm saying, oh, I didn't see that one in my textbook. What's the name of that one? Really weird. I'm sure Miss McGuigan would um, <laughs> raise an eyebrow or two. And that was our teacher back then. Hmm. But anyway, it's a beautiful morning. As I'm walking around the garden, I'm hearing the birds. There we go. The blackbirds, and especially, are just picking off what I left of the black currants. I mean, the thing is, you've always got to leave some for the birds. Because they feast on them. It's called fair share. Permaculture principles. And fair share isn't just about sharing with human beings, it's about sharing with every other living thing on the planet. The thrush and the blackbird, small birds, big birds, they come down here in the early morning and have a real feast. They're in there, look. Just where those black corn bushes are. The oregano is coming out into flower. And the bees are loving it. The evening primroses in flower and the fuchsia. Bees love all of those. And the mint is looking beautiful. And there's poppies come up amongst the potatoes. Oh, look at the tunnel. I've been working quite hard in here, getting everything sorted out. And I've planted out the rest of the very straggly looking tomatoes because there'll be a small crop to be had from them. There's two there together, giving each other a bit of support. There's a beautiful bee up there. compost. Lots of beautiful poppies there in the compost. Lots of sedum as well. And I've been clearing the paths, so adding to the bulk on the compost heaps. I may have to start another one. Spotted this beautiful flower on the potato on one of the potato plants. Lots of seed in the lovage. And there's the beautiful curling tops 
of the Krukal's Mere. I've cut back some of the lemon balm. 